Hello, welcome to Indie Tutorials. My name is Guillermo and I would like to thank the Patreon supporting this channel. Hello everyone. It has been two years since I started the channel and uh, as a token of appreciation and thanks for your support all the way, I'm going to start uploading the projects we've been working on and um, for example here the dark RPG I have removed the paid asset and uh, replaced the enemy with uh, this from unity volume I believe is the name and uh, the challenger as well as I change uh, orc framework for the light version So we are using the the light version or free light version as well as the animancer uh, I changed to the light version as well. So from here you can follow a little bit better the the project, the episodes and all the changes. Of course, if you have already the pro version of both Animancer and Game is Love, just change those libraries. But at least you can follow along a little bit better, I, be, I guess. So let me click play to just make a, a little bit of showcase what we have here. Let me see if I can start from that view because volume volume has a nice animation you see it's opening the arms and of course we still have the same logic the same movement set targeting as we left in the last week so if I were to go now to the teleport I have to remove the of course the visual effects that were were paid and uh, yeah we have the HUD as we had before and as well what I did is to add in the project the uh, Viking uh, lining optimization project from unity so if I go to the scene changer I call this scene the village so I can just change here the scene changer to move to the village instead remember that we need to of course add those to the build settings so if I were to click play Now we are in the village. Of course, um, I didn't um, prepare this scene properly. Uh, we can see that there are some missing props, perhaps uh, due to the uh, layers naming or the layers expected to be to render those assets. But you get the idea. What I wanted to do is to to get some somehow a bigger environment to load for the next um, one of the next episodes regarding the loading screen. We are going to build a custom loading screen, and uh, I wanted to have a bigger scene to load afterwards to see how it goes. But anyways, I really I really want to thank you all for supporting the channel. And I hope uh, you like it, that I'm going to release those uh, these projects, the Dark IRPG, uh, the Lightning Returns. Uh, of course, uh, I'm going to release it. Not not the one made in Orc 2, but the new one. I'm just uh, trying to find a good free asset to include 
and to be sure that I can actually release those. So, well, thank you and uh, see you on the next one.